Welcome to the Luxygen channel, the exciting space where people go to get their fix in the Luxygen world of billionaires, luxury, finance, and inspirational fulfillment. Be sure to like, smash the notification bell, and subscribe to our channel as we will be uploading Luxygen rich videos frequently. Thank you for joining us for today's video where we will take a look at 15 game changing technologies that have the potential to change the world and how we live. Number 15. Spin Launch In recent years, there has been a lot of attention paid to private space businesses and their efforts to create vehicles that can transport paying clients into orbit. However, because of the pollution caused by traditional space flight, these advancements will not benefit anyone except billionaires for a long time. However, there is a lesser known company that is making significant progress in making space technologies significantly more affordable environmentally friendly and accessible. It's just that they're more interested in satellites than in human flight. The principle behind spin launch is actually quite simple. Although of course, putting that into practice is exceedingly difficult. They are developing a kinetic energy launch method to place satellites into orbit. They were founded in 2014 and are financed by significant companies such as Airbus and Google. They have created a vacuum sealed centrifuge that will spin items around before sending them into space at speeds of up to 5,000 miles per hour. And once they reach suborbital height, a typical rocket booster will take over. This innovation decreases the amount of fuel that must be burned, and to make things even better, all of the energy utilized to operate the centrifuge comes from renewable sources like solar and wind. The company has even demonstrated that most standard satellite components can endure the 10,000 Gs that they'll be subjected to during a launch, and estimated that sending one into space will cost less than half a million dollars, rather than the tens of millions it costs now. They expect the full-size device to be ready soon, after the test version is completed and launched. Within a few years, this might completely change the way satellites are launched. Number 14 graphene. Industries are constantly looking for new materials that will provide stronger and more reliable performance, but graphene is likely to be the next game-changing invention. It's a chemical that's been predicted for a long time, but has proven to be so difficult to make that it's just now become practical. It is generated from graphite, which is utilized in pencils made completely of carbon atoms, as the name suggests. Graphite is a three-dimensional structure whereas graphene is two-dimensional, meaning the carbon atoms are perfectly aligned in an hexagonal honeycomb shape that is only 0.3 nanometers thick and there are only 0.1 nanometers between each atom. In practice, this new system provides significant benefits that are only now beginning to be fully appreciated. Graphene, for example, can conduct electricity more effectively than copper. It's also 200 times stronger than steel while only weighing six times as much. It's nearly transparent since it absorbs only 2% of light and is impenetrable to all gases, even the lightest ones. Chemical components can also be added to the surface to change its properties. Graphene, according to researchers, is more of a platform that developers will be able to arrange to suit their needs. It has a variety of uses for electronics, for example, and could revolutionize touchscreen technologies. It could also be used to build lighter composite materials. The possibilities are essentially boundless, and commercial production is predicted to be viable within the next decade. Number 13. GPS-3 The American GPS satellite network, which began in 1973, was finished in 1993, was the first global navigational system, and it transformed the way everyone determines where they are on Earth. The advantages were originally intended for military use, but the technology had already impacted every aspect of our lives from the way certain devices work to sat-nav systems and location-based tracking. The difficulty with GPS is that the initial 24 satellites, as well as the additional ones that were later added, do not give perfect resolution and are only accurate to a few feet. They also don't have complete coverage all around the world. Anyone who has tried to use positioning monitoring in mountainous or densely populated places know that the signals are relatively cheap to jam which poses a persistent threat to military applications. As a result, there is a strong desire to improve the system, and the technology to do so has already been established. The satellites, known as GPS-3, 
and produced by Lockheed Martin, have already been deployed and are anticipated to completely modernize the network in a few years. When the project is finished, the signal will be eight times stronger and significantly more exact than they are now, ensuring that they cannot be blocked, resulting in increased safety signal integrity and accuracy. Number 12. Floating Farms As the world's population grows, one of the most pressing issues we confront is how to produce enough food to meet everyone's requirements. Surprisingly, agriculture occupies approximately 30% of the global land surface with a third of that dedicated to crops and the remaining two-thirds dedicated to grazing livestock, which not only limits potential areas for inhabitation, but also encourages large-scale deforestation and habitat change. Some corporations are exploring for ways to develop additional farmland, and you may have heard of vertical farms, which aim to increase yield for the same size of piece of land. Others are considering considerably more drastic approaches, one is the concept of floating farms, which entails the construction of massive complexes that sit on the ocean's surface, can be transported to where they're needed, and are, most importantly, transitory. They take regions that would otherwise be unused and transform them into a commercial commodity. Surprisingly, one of these has already been in use for several years. In the Dutch port of Rotterdam, a business named Belladon has built a floating platform to farm 40 Muse Rhine Issel cows that are milked by robots while manufacturing the product as close to the end consumer as feasible. They're also lowering transportation expenses. They also want to be able to set up floating farms in disaster-stricken areas to get food production up and running much faster than would be possible otherwise. Number 11. Edge Computing in the last few decades, the way we use computers has changed dramatically, as has the way technology is developed to provide us with the best possible service. Anything used to be done on a single device in our houses, but today, we most likely utilize cloud computing, in which most of our actions from emails to documents to nearly everything else are stored online, and our devices are effectively windows that provide us access to this. However, the problem with cloud computing is that most businesses rely on the infrastructure of only a few cloud providers, Amazon, Microsoft, Google, and IBM, with Amazon alone accounting for 47% of the market. Simply put, everything that can be moved to the cloud has already been done, and there is very little possibility for growing in that area. Thus, others have started looking at the cloud's quote and unquote edge. What this really implies is that they're looking at ways to put cloud processing and storage closer to where the users are, rather than relying on a few data centers in order to improve the user's experience. More work will be done locally, with the goal of lowering latency, improving privacy and security, and reducing bandwidth utilization so that the infrastructure does not buckle under the strain of greater traffic. In many respects, it appears to be abandoning the concept of cloud computing but it is actually utilizing it to its maximum potential. You'll be able to access your internet material considerably more quickly if fingerprint or facial authorization is handled directly by your smartphone, rather than waiting for a server to respond. Self-driving automobiles, on the other hand, are currently the best illustration of edge computing. It can function autonomously rather than waiting for a server's response, but it must be centrally controlled so that it can be automatically updated and the algorithms can be improved. Number 10. Self-Healing Concrete Concrete is one of the world's most widely used construction materials in the world, coming in second only to water in terms of consumption. Surprisingly, construction uses twice as much concrete as all other materials combined. This equates to more than three tons of waste per person in the world each year. The difficulty is that although being a resistant and durable material, it is sensitive to wear and strain and can develop fractures and holes which can compromise its long-term stability. This means that it must be maintained or replaced in order to avoid an expensive disaster. However, scientists have devised a new solution, self-healing concrete. An astonishing thing happens when you combine bacterial spores with a food supply like yeast extract in the concrete mix. When the concrete fractures, the bacteria are exposed to oxygen and water, and they begin to devour and proliferate the food eventually producing calcium carbonate or limestone as a byproduct. 
This, in turn, reseals the fracture, and if done correctly, you won't be able to tell where the crack started in the first place. The treatment can be completed in about 14 days for tiny gaps, and it will prevent them from growing and becoming a bigger problem. It's believed that in the not-too-distant future, almost all concrete will have technology like this, putting an end to the days of potentially dangerous flaws. Number 9. Hydrogen Fuel Cells While electric and battery concepts appear to be the way forward, they aren't magic bullet. The automotive industry is undergoing its most significant transition in living memory, with practically every manufacturer attempting to develop their own solutions to lessen reliance on fossil fuels. There are issues about getting green electricity to everyone who needs it, as well as the fact that our electrical networks aren't prepared to manage the loads that will be necessary, even if everything works out. There's also the matter that batteries are relatively hefty for the amounts of charge that they can retain. And although they may be adequate for automobiles, larger trucks, ships, and planes are not yet viable options. As a result, another alternative is required, and hydrogen fuel is the most likely candidate. Hydrogen may be created using a variety of techniques, including natural gas, nuclear power, biomass, and even other renewable energies, and the only byproduct is water when it is consumed. A model train has been fitted with hydrogen cells and is undergoing tests in the UK, while aircraft manufacturers such as Airbus regard this as a far more viable aim in the near future than full electrification, and automotive firms are looking at how it may be utilized as well. The technology is nearing the point where it can be used in a variety of applications, and it's only a matter of time until it becomes widespread. Number 8. Satellite Constellations as the cost of putting satellites into orbit decreases, component design improves, and the potential use of space technology expands, a number of major technology corporations are considering the feasibility of forming their own satellite constellations. The concept of a network of satellites doing a specific function isn't precisely new. After all, there are already six different navigational satellite constellations such as GPS and a variety of one-way and two-way communication satellite constellations, but they have usually operated with only a few hundred nodes. SpaceX has recently begun work on its own constellation, Starlink, which, once completed, will provide internet connection to the majority of the world. Amazingly, this entails putting as many as 12,000 people in orbit to provide ideal coverage, and while the corporation is leading the way, it isn't the only one considering it. Boeing OneWeb and Amazon are both developing their own constellations to give internet connectivity, and this is only the beginning of what they can be used for. You might be able to see some of these satellites already if you look up at night, and if advancement continues at this rate, the night sky will soon be full of them. Number 7. GPT-3 Tech companies all around the world are racing to produce their first full artificial intelligence but there are milestones along the road that could have a far greater influence on the technology we use and how we live. Deep learning is one of these concepts in which computer systems examine previous behavior and automatically develop methods to increase performance. GPT-3 is one of the more intriguing types of this. It's the third generation of a language prediction model developed by OpenAI, and the aim is that it can compose words in the same way a person does, based on self-learning. It is one of the most difficult sorts of human imitation, and the most recent attempt is nearly amazing. According to preliminary research, it's nearly hard to tell whether something was written by GPT-3 or by a real person, and corporations such as Microsoft have already begun to incorporate it into their products. GPT-3, which has just been dubbed one of the most interesting and crucial AI systems ever produced will further blur the distinction between fact and fiction, and you may find yourself reading news stories or even novels that have had no human participation at all. Number 6. Connected Homes Throughout history, inventions have allowed us to save time on simple chores so that we can devote our attention to more difficult jobs, and this trend is continuing into the 21st century. While the concept of connected houses isn't new in and of itself, the growing prevalence of the internet and technological improvements means it will become far more widespread, trustworthy, and functional in the next years. 
The market in the United States alone was about $6 billion in 2013, and it is believed that 37% of U.S. households currently have a smart device. They normally take the form of doorbells, heated light bulbs, speakers, and voice-activated help right now. But there are so many various ways technology may be included that things will look very different in a few years. Almost everything that is electrically operated, from connected refrigerators to power plugs, bathroom appliances, and even furniture, might have a chip place that allows it to be controlled by a smart device or just by your voice. Furthermore, because so much of it is automated, our homes will look after themselves, allowing us to devote more time to our hobbies and families. Number 5. Lithium Metal Battery Right now, there is a lot of focus on shifting away from emission-producing energy, and one of the greatest ways to do so is to convert everything we use to run on electricity, as long as the electricity comes from green sources. Significant progress has been achieved in recent decades, but one of the most significant bottlenecks is the battery's capacity. A lithium-ion battery is now the most reliable and cost-effective design, but it has limitations in terms of how much it can charge and how rapidly it can do so as well as safety problems if it is broken. QuantumScape is working on an alternative that is solid rather than liquid, like a lithium-ion battery. According to the results of the company's early experiments, the battery is known as a lithium metal battery. These could boost the range of an electric car by up to 80% in the future, and they can be recharged in a quarter of the time. The prototypes are now too huge to be installed in automobiles, but they are projected to shrink significantly in the next years, to the point that QuantumScape has already struck a deal with Volkswagen to begin selling electric vehicles equipped with the new batteries in 2025. Number 4. 3D Printing Since its inception in the 1980s, 3D printing has had a tumultuous past, and until recently, it has only been helpful for extremely narrow purposes essentially putting liquefied material into a chamber and building a 3D item layer by layer. It's a technology most commonly used to make little plastic objects or replacement parts for electronic equipment. 3D printers are increasingly becoming able to manufacture objects out of different substances as our understanding of materials have increased, and they are being hailed as the future of production, from apparel and food to medical devices and the ability to rapidly prototype new ideas. The possibilities are unlimited, but arguably, the most interesting aspect is how major projects will be affected. There are now a lot of structures created by 3D printed elements throughout the world, and this is only going to become frequent. Instead of shipping all of the many types of bricks and other elements needed to create a house, all that is required is a supply of the basic materials and printer, and everything can be made on site. It will cut transportation needs, waste, and boost efficiency perhaps allowing for the construction of new homes in a quarter of the time it currently takes. Number 3. Blockchains When individuals hear the word blockchain, they have two reactions. Either they begin telling you about the finest cryptocurrencies to invest in, or they become bored and turn off. While blockchain technology underpins the operation of these new decentralized currencies, it is only the beginning of how helpful and integrated it will become in our daily lives. Simply explained, a blockchain is a list of data linked together by a cryptographic mechanism, and once added, a block cannot be modified and serves as a permanent record. This was originally used to prove who owned a specific coin, or more recently, a digital piece of art. However, a lot of companies are investigating how much broader the applications can go. There are already examples of blockchain being used to facilitate energy trading and a variety of other activities. But probably the most essential application is the ability to track the history of specific products. The food business will gain greatly from this since it will be possible to establish where and when ingredients were farmed or prepared, and companies will be able to use blockchain to prove whether an item is genuine or counterfeit. Number 2. Fighting Fire with Sound Wildfires are becoming increasingly common around the world as a result of our changing climate and they're becoming more difficult to contain. In California alone, for example, five times the area is currently burning each year than it was in the 1970s. This is only going to get worse. Traditionally, massive amounts of water or foam were used to extinguish or at least limit the spread of fires. 
but with water limitations and a reluctance to drop chemicals onto the ground, an alternative can't come soon enough. Fortunately, a solution was originally proposed in 2015 and has since progressed to the point where it will soon be implemented on a broad scale. The acoustic extinguisher called Kitchens uses sound waves to drive oxygen away from a fire source and spread it out over a larger area. This removes the fire's fuel and, if left alone for long enough, will simply cause it to go out. There have been previous attempts, but now that the ideal frequencies and methodologies have been determined, it is extremely possible that this will become one of the primary firefighting strategies in the next decades. Number 1. Quantum Computing We all rely on traditional computers for day-to-day -day operations. But there comes a point where no matter how many powerful chips you bring together, they can't execute very complex jobs. Since the 1980s, computer scientists from all around the world have been working on the next big thing, building a quantum computer. And they're no closer than they've ever been. In essence, a quantum computer differs from a traditional computer in the way it stores and processes data. A classical computer uses bits that can be either a 1 or a 0, whereas a quantum computer uses qubits, which can be in either a 1 or a 0 quantum state, or a superposition of both. This indicates that a quantum computer can solve any issue that a classical computer can, and vice versa, and in some cases, it will be more efficient. One of the more intriguing aspects of quantum computers is that they will not always be the better option, and researchers are still investigating the scenarios in which they will be advantageous. Right now, the biggest challenge is building one that is large and stable enough to see how well it can perform. Thank you for joining us for this Insider Access review of 15 of technological advancements that will change the world and how we live. Let us know your thoughts on these technologies in the comments below. Stay tuned to the Luxygen channel where we will feature more content about living life luxuriously. Don't forget that by liking this clip, as well as subscribing within our channel and clicking on that notification bell button, not only are you helping us grow, but also other people around the world.